Okay, we are back, and um, this is our new support character. His abilities are Covering Fire and Field Medic. Um, I think Field Medic is in fact a very useful perk, especially for this early in the game, because you don't particularly have the uh, easiest of times. It does mean that um, if you go to his um, loadout, he gets free med kits, so very useful. Um, uh, welcome Mrs. Yu, um, she's a rookie. Um, from China. Um, Mr. Smith will be joining us again. Um, he's actually been doing pretty well, but as far as my usual snipers go, this dude's actually been alright. Um, like, he's not died yet, so... Uh, and of course, um, Adram, um, who is basically being a heavy, so let's launch a mission. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. This is Big Sky. We're just north of the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Alright, so um, this mission is a little bit different from normal. Um, there is going to be another alien in this we've not encountered yet called the Outsider. He's basically the boss of the aircraft and he can be very, very, very damaging to our team if we're not careful. So what we're going to do is make sure that we all move in together. Alright. Unfortunately, she's still a rookie, so aiming at walls is what she does. Okay, so looks like her sniper can see a couple of people. 65%, we'll take that. That's looking pretty good. Yep. Man, he is becoming quite the force to be reckoned with already. He's not even gotten any of his decent abilities yet. Okay, that's a 27% chance. We're going to keep you on overwatch, I think, while we move the rest of our guys up. We're going to have a... Uh... We're going to have our rookie dash up a bit closer. He's going to start panicking and running away, I think. Very well done. That's by the numbers, I'd say. Moving. Okay, that big glowing blue thing obviously is the UFO, so we do have to be very careful. Um, okay, where would be a good spot for this person? Um, Let's do this. Visual on the goods. Okay, so yeah, I'd say you go and Overwatch. What we'll do is we'll actually start dragging a bunch of people over here. I'm on it, Commander. Park it. Okay, so let's say the sniper gets to go That's over here. Gives him a pretty nice view into the actual UFO itself. Should we just tell him to reload his gun? That's probably the most useful thing we can do with that. We get our veteran uh, support unit to. Yeah, we don't want to move up too forward because uh, we actually don't know what's out there yet. Moving. We're over here and go on Overwatch. Okay, looks like there's some aliens over here. Ah, 
Alright, so can he see anything? He's got it here. Okay, that's the Outlander. You need to do that. Okay, now, um, this could sound a bit weird, but we do need to blow up this guy's cover and, like, right now. This is what we're gonna do. This guy needs to die like yesterday, so. Okay, and. The sniper will take care of him. I'm about to start keeping score. Alright, okay, so. That's the biggest threat of this mission over and dealt with, so that's good. Um, Does the rocket reach? No. <laughs> no, it does not. Okay, uh. Location confirmed. 36% chance to hit. Uh. Actually, I'd say you need to go over here. Get yourself into some actual decent cover and maybe go on Overwatch. This mill's gonna expire unless we actually go up and grab it, so I'm gonna send a rookie to go do that. And I'm actually finally gonna tell this guy to stay on Overwatch. You might see the alien, you might not. That's unfortunate. He's just gonna Overwatch in the middle of the road there, that's... That's some interesting shit. Okay, uh it's been okay, we'll do that before we try anything else. Okay, so sixty-seven. You know what, let's just end this. It's just one alien. I don't really care. Chalk up another one. Yeah, I don't think the rookie got any kills during that, but that's fine. She did a job, she she played a part of the team and actually got the uh got the aliens uh, cover away from them, Looks so like they're really taking care of business down there. And without so much as a scratch. Okay, uh definitely hollow targeting. That's definitely gonna be useful. Uh and ooh look, sniper. Now definitely squad sight. Now this is pretty good because it allows you to take two shots in a turn. This is actually much better because you like to shoot people through walls. And to be honest, it's it's the always, always the thing I go for first. So uh, we do have a damaged. Uh, we have medals available in the barracks, Commander. If you feel any soldiers merit an award, we do. Okay, so those we can't do anything with, so you may as well get rid of. Uh, we got some medals, urban combat. Award this medal. I'd say we award it to our support. He is our most valuable member of our team right now. And we also have sign power plus two will against uh, a different nationality squad plus two aim for a content bonus. I'd say we're gonna go for that. We're gonna be we're gonna actually um, attempt this here. Alright, so... Alright, we got a bunch of money. Can we do anything? Oh, we could technically build the officer training school, but not just yet. We really actually need that money for the uh, satellite uplink. It's not available yet. We could technically make it available. We can build the workshop. It's not an issue. Excavation complete. All right, xenobiology is definitely I a thing we're going to be. I expected that would be a priority research task, Commander. 
I'll begin allocating resources to the project immediately. Okay, uh, build by items. Um, we definitely need a fiber vest, so we're going to build one of these right now. Um, it's just a point. Um, build by items. Do we have anything aircraft related? No. So. Commander, we're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Okay, so all of these are pretty easy to take. I would say that we actually do need the scientists right now. Um, we are a bit behind on that. Um, eh, and it's also an easy mission. We check the uh, situation room. Yeah, I'd say definitely do Europe. It's an easy mission and also it stops uh, France from freaking out even further. Um, so when we return, we'll go grab ourselves some scientists. I'll see you guys then.